Hi, beautiful people. It's a new day and a new practice as we bring our hands to heart center, setting an intention for the day. Resting our hands on our knees as we drop our ear, right ear to right shoulder, and then left ear to left shoulder. Stretching out the neck to start with. Taking the head forward, chin to chest. And then head back. Ponytail to spine. We've got a real energizing, energy raising practice today. As we just move our head in slow, small, circular motions in one direction and then back the other way. Kind of feels like you're giving your neck and upper shoulders a bit of a massage. Then taking our head, nodding it from left to right. Remembering to breathe with each transition of the movement. And then nodding the head up and down. Interlacing the fingers, bringing the arms above the head, leaning to the right, then over to the left, back to the right, warming up that spine. And then turning the hands so that they face the body Stretching the shoulders. I love this stretch. It feels so good. <clears throat> I'm going to run through three cat cows. So dropping our stomach and chest towards the earth as we pull our head back and then taking our gaze between our legs, curving the spine into cat, inhaling into cow pose, exhaling into cat pose. One more. Tucking the toes, downward facing dog. It felt so nice feeling the early morning sun hit my body this morning. And then being able to warm up all the muscles, get the blood flowing as we move our left foot forward, coming into warrior one. And then we're going to melt the upper body over that front leg as we scoop the arms forward. And then bringing them back to the side. Scooping all that energy in towards the body and then opening the arms up. One more. As we lift the back leg now, we're going to bring the arms down by our side and balance on our left leg. Coming into Tadasana as we touch the feet together. Shoulders away from the ears and then sinking straight down into chair pose. We're going to take our arms down the side of our body. Three times each side. Inhaling, exhaling, inhaling, exhaling. Standing. And then taking the right leg back, or left leg I should say, <laughs> right leg forward. I'm just going to scoop all that energy as we fold over that front leg. And then opening up the chest. So we get a nice stretch through the legs, but also working the upper body as well. And again, planting down, balancing on the right leg, left leg long, arms down by our side, getting the body parallel with the mat, and then standing, feet together, forward folding over the legs, placing the hands on the ground at the feet, halfway lift, forward fold, jumping back into downward facing dog, or you can step back if you like. Pedaling out the legs again if that feels good. High plank, chaturanga. As we come onto our bellies, three baby cobras. Inhaling, exhaling as we lower. Inhaling, 
Exhaling, pushing back into downward facing dog. This time the left leg coming forward, warrior one. Turning the back foot, coming into warrior two. Flipping the front palm, reverse warrior. And then side angle pose. Coming back into warrior two. Framing the front foot, dropping the back knee, untucking the toes, low lunge. Taking the left foot back into downward facing dog. High plank, lowering down three baby cobras, using your hands to push the upper body up and then slowly lowering. Tucking the toes, downward facing dog. Bringing the right foot forward this time. Warrior one. Pivoting that back foot, coming into warrior two. Flipping the front palm, reverse warrior. And then side angle pose. Framing the front foot again. Dropping the back knee, low lunge, pushing that pelvis towards the earth. Tucking the toes, downward facing dog. High plank, chaturanga. Three baby cobras. Tucking the toes, downward facing dog. Should be feeling nice and warm now, maybe even starting to sweat as we jump the feet forward between the hands. Halfway lift, forward fold. Big deep breath in as we take the arms high above our head. Chair pose. Arms high. And then three times each side, taking both arms Getting rid of any stress, any negative energy, anything that's not serving us, get rid of it. Send it behind us. We do not need it anymore. And then chair pose, bringing all the beautiful energy in now, scooping it forward, bringing it towards the body, scooping in two more times. And then forward folding, letting all that energy build in the body, all that positive energy feeling the lightness of it now that we got rid of all that heavy energy we've got all this beautiful light energy showering us in its morning glory in its light as we slowly stand bringing both feet to the side of the mat now goddess pose palms together above our head maybe getting a little bit lower if you can Bringing hands to our heart. Hands on our hips, forward folding the upper body and then moving the body weight over to the right. Walking the hands and moving the body over to the left, stretching the inside of the legs here. Back over to the right. Walking over to the left. One more time, each side. Beautiful, back to center. And then maybe grabbing the shins if that feels good. Pulling the upper body closer to the legs. Or you can grab the elbows if you like. Hang a little bit heavier. And then swaying from side to side. Jumping the feet in a little bit, dropping straight into our yogic squat. So pushing the knees out with our arms, hands together in prayer position. Our bottoms hovering above the earth. 
We're feeling that energy come through the soles of our feet and go up and around the body. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling very warm right now as we balance on our sit bones. Maybe resting the head on the knees. Then we're going to extend the, extend the arms out first and then slightly extend the legs out. Using your core to maintain that balance and stability. And then turning the body around and gently lowering the body to the floor, curling up in a little ball as we bring our knees to our chest. And coming into a back bend. Pressing up through the hands and the feet. Trying to get those hips as high as you can. And then slowly lowering back to the mat. Bridge pose as we take our hips high now. Pressing down through the arms and the feet. And then bringing the left leg up and over the right, turning our head towards the left. Two deep breaths here. And then over to the right side, right leg up and over, taking our gaze over to the right. Hugging the knees in one more time. And then bringing the soles of the feet together. Knees are wide and then pushing the legs away from the body, creating space between the vertebrae and the sacrum. Pushing, pushing, pushing. And then gently releasing, bringing the knees together, letting them fall in heavy in the middle as our feet go wide. And just resting here for a moment before taking the legs long and coming into Savasana. Just ta taking some deep breaths here. I'm just gonna place our hands on our heart and really honor ourselves today, sending extra love to the most important person, the one who is showing up for you every single day and being really grateful for your physical self, your spiritual, mental, everything. Just showering yourself in so much love and gratitude. And knowing that it's okay that you're not where you thought you would be in life or in health or in fitness. Like being kinder to yourself, forgiving and just loving yourself wholly for who you are. The good bits, the messy, the not so good bits. It's all perfectly imperfect. So really feel that right now. And one more big deep breath here. Feel that heart with so much love. It feels like it's bursting out of you as we stretch up now and then give ourselves a big tight hug before rolling over to one side and sitting up into seated pose. And then take a big deep breath in, bringing our hands to our third eye. May we have kind and loving thoughts today as we lower our hands to our lips. May we speak kind and loving words today as we lower our hands to our heart. May we have kind and loving intentions today. Beautiful practice. I hope you're nice and warm, feeling energized for the day. Have a beautiful day, everybody. Namaste.